Show me your cock. Introduction. I know what's going on in your head. This book is not for the lube by your bed. Although it's a rooster I think you'll enjoy, a tale about some cocks and a boy. So please don't be scared to read this out loud to your innocent child or a large crowd. The weather was perfect one day after school. I thought I'd swim in the neighbourhood pool. I put on my trunks and started to walk. That's when my neighbour showed me his cock. The time had come. It was my birthday. My best friend came over, but what shall we play? We went to my room and turned back the lock. That's when my friend showed me his cock. One night after school, I couldn't sleep. I tried to read. I tried counting sheep. I snuck in my parents' room. Oh, what a shock! My daddy was showing my mummy his cock. Third grade is fun, my teacher would say. Barely any work and mostly play. When recess came, he wanted to talk, so he pulled me aside and showed me his cock. My first confession was especially fun. The priest pulled me in and called me his son. He read, like a shepherd, he will tend to his flock. And that's when the priest showed me his cock. My grandpa Charlie was losing his mind. I think it all started when he went blind. He walked to my house in a hat and one sock. That's when he showed my family his cock. My skin has wrinkled, my hair's turned grey. I'm lucky to witness this brand new day. I watched the sunrise while I put on my socks, and as I eat breakfast, I think about cocks. Now Grandpa, my parents, my teacher, my priest, my neighbour and best friend are all deceased. When death comes home and I hear him knock, I'll welcome him in and show him my cock. Word.